Well, it's that time of year again. You know, when uh, people give each other presents and uh, you give somebody a present, but you, you, you mustn't you mustn't expect a present in return because that's not the spirit of Christmas, is it? <laughs> uh, families fall out at Christmas or are known to. Um, all sorts of things happen at Christmas. Uh, when... when uh, when we were first married, my father used to come to us for Christmas and um, we'd have him for nearly two weeks entertaining him. Oh, it was hard work. Anyway, one of the first times um, at Christmas, he came and on Christmas Day, we had a great big habitat table that we'd bought. It was quite expensive anyway. And it was situated in, in a... Um, a bay window well it was square actually box window whichever so um there was me my wife our son and my my father so uh, he decided that he was going to go round the other side of the table and sit in the window facing us with his back to the to the outside well at that time we also had a habitat sideboard which was about nine feet long and black so i i'd got a real christmas tree and i'd fitted it in there with plaster and whatnot um <laughs> to make it steady or so i thought anyway i didn't want to put earth in so we went round past the Christmas tree and the meals were all laid out there. Lovely Christmas Day dinner and then he knocked the tree over. So all the pine needles came off in everybody's food except his. Now on Boxing Day he did the same thing again. But we were having um, some rather expensive steak that day. But none of the needles fell in his. I could tell you more, chapter and verse, but I won't. And we ended up having him for years and years and years because we couldn't get out of it really, but still. Anyway, I digress. What I was going to say was, it's the time when the Christmas CDs come out. And uh, not quite so much these days because I think if people want certain Christmas tracks, they just download them now. But years ago, uh, you go into Woolworths or in any of the retailers that sold music and they'd always have a selection of uh, Christmas compilations. Anyway, one of the ones that was sent to me years ago by a record company, I think it was, uh, I think this was Polygram or Sony or whichever, was this one. The Christmas Album. Very uh inspiring now underneath this there used to be a square and uh, if you took this cover out and shook it it was a snowstorm you know like you used to have years ago and you shook it and there was like a snow scene and well it was like that and it was great for some years then it's the snow started going yellowy color and the snow which was not snow and then the bits clumped together so I ended up having to throw it away in the end because people would ask what the hell it was anyway this one in a fat box 2 CD let's see what's on it uh, first CD wham last Christmas uh, Greg Lake I believe in father no I beg your pardon wham last Christmas Greg Lake I believe in father Christmas East 17 stay another day I quite like that song Frankie Goes to Hollywood, The Power of Love. Another one I'm quite keen on. The Pogues featuring Kirsty McCall, Fairy Tale of New York. I wonder if they'll re-release that this this Christmas, um, considering Sean, uh, Shane McGowan's um, passing. Uh, Steps, Heartbeat, Shaking Stevens, Merry Christmas Everyone. Jonah Louis, Stop the Cavalry, a lot of these, you know, the old chestnuts. Uh, Elton John, Step Into Christmas, Boney M, Mary's Boy Child. I won't mention this next artist. Then The Pretenders, 2,000 Miles, 
Chris Rear driving home for Christmas, shaking Stevens again, Blue Christmas, Bruce Springsteen, the street man, Merry Christmas, baby, Luther Vandross, have yourself a merry little Christmas, Backstreet Boys, Christmas time, 3T, Endless Christmas, and Jane McDonald, White Christmas. There are some duplications on this, though. Then we go on to CD2. God, it's really scraping the barrel. Bing Crosby, White Christmas, Frank Sinatra, Let It Snow, Let It Snow, Tony Bennett, Winter Wonderland, Johnny Mathis, this must be for the mums and dads, uh, Johnny Mathis, When a Boy Child is Born, Harry Belafonte, Mary's Boy Child, Elvis Presley, Blue Christmas again, David Essex, A Winter's Tale, nice song, Eartha Kitt, Santa Baby, when I was in the choir, we used to do that at Christmas, you know, Santa Baby. Uh, I was always frightened of Earth Kiss as a child. I used to do that thing that people say about the kids and the Daleks hiding behind the settee. I think it was it was a voice frightened me. Not a singing voice, anyway. The Wombles, Wombling Merry Christmas, Jackson 5, Frosty the Snowman, Darlene Love, All Alone on Christmas, uh, Gladys Knight, The Christmas Song, Robson and Jerome. Remember when they used to sing our big hits together? Um, I believe Jane MacDonald again have yourself a merry little Christmas another one s someone else did on the other CD I think uh, Doris Day I'll be home for Christmas Dolly Parton and Kenny Rogers Medley Winter Wonderland Cindy Lauper Early Christmas Morning Michael Bolton Santa Claus is coming to town Gloria Estefan Christmas Through Your Eyes Human Nature Last Christmas, I don't remember that. Um, Mariah Carey, Oh Holy Night, Neil Diamond, You Make It Feel Like Christmas, Barbara Streisand, The Lord's Prayer, and Gay Gordon, Old Lang Syne. Some of those I have never heard of. I used to shake the CD, you see, and you'd be able to see the snow coming, uh, um, well, it would be in front, actually, and look as though you could see the Santa there. In the actual snowstorm what a piece of nonsense uh, this wasn't the best it missed out a lot of the other ones that we know like uh, uh, Slade um, it's Christmas and um, the other one I wished it could be Christmas every day no I didn't no I didn't when all these songs when I worked in retail all these songs used to be played constantly at Christmas and it used to drive me around the bend and other members of staff. And uh, I've spoken to people that work in retail outlets now, like in supermarkets. Some of them, some of them managed to switch their brains off to, uh, to the music and others say that they find it incredibly irritating. Still, I wonder if you treated yourself to a Christmas compilation this year or whether you've just downloaded a couple of tracks on your phone. Let me know because uh, it'd be an education. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up if you enjoyed this. And don't forget, you can always subscribe and then you won't miss any of the videos. Bye for now. And Merry Christmas.